Good morning. Wednesday morning, heading now to Yishon Lutzion to moderate the first panel of one of the biggest conferences of the year, Future of AI. This is the second year in a row. Last year I was the MC. This year that was a bit much for me, so I'm just moderating the first panel. It's going to be a crazy cool event, and my boy Ben Pellet from People and Computers puts on some spectacular events. Pretty impressed by their work. After that, heading to Powtoon for the day. Lunch with a company called Verifind that reached out to me and does some uh, pretty cool online verification uh, technology and a couple of other meetings. And then tonight, or this afternoon, late afternoon meeting, the CEO of one of the biggest shopping centers in Israel and one of the biggest names in retail in the country. Not sure exactly what the context of the meeting is, but he reached out and he's a fantastic dude. He's been on the vlog before, or in Paran, and looking forward to meeting him. So it's gonna be a jam-packed, pretty exciting, pretty geeky day. Here we go. on at like 7 10 a.m something like that i think the panel's at like 805 it's a pretty beautiful place here never been here before What up, dude? What's well, cooking? Good looking. Told me to come early. I came early. You're the man. You're the man. The only guy with a better beard than me. <laughs> you're, you're doing a lot. I see. You're yeah. What, what does it say? What the? Read. Wait. Do what you love. Amazing. We work, baby. We work. Good luck Talk today, bro. Work. Good luck. Thank you very much. Talk later, man. Go All do right. your thing. Thank you. Where you are looking for something to drink. I'm looking for something to drink. And I thought you'd never ask. I can make red alert. Green and tonic or Roots Ninja. Yeah, the Roots Ninja. Your Roots Ninja is being mixed. Your Roots Ninja is ready. Thank you. You are welcome. Enjoy your drink in the conference. I'm underage. Can I get a Coke Zero? Sorry, only Pepsi. <laughs> Just kidding. I only make cocktails. Cool stuff, cool stuff. This guy right here, this is fantastic lighting. Oh man, I should move in here. <laughs> this guy, first of all, where's my... It's in the back. Good, in the back. good. <laughs> good answer. All right, so Ben Pellet, despite us having the same last name, almost fold Pellet, we're not related. You know, I'm a big fan. This guy's kicking some serious butt. People in computers, you guys are one of the top event producers globally uh -huh. in Israel for sure. How many people are coming today? 1,500 people from 25 countries. 1,500 mm -hmm. people? That's Which incredible. is big in Israel, right? Is Country of 8 million people. Is your dad gonna be My here? dad is in New York, in another conference in New York, actually. Busy what? man, right? 72 Dude, years old. What do you think I'm doing here? I came to see your dad. <laughs> His dad is like we'll the arrange, most- I'll arrange a meeting. The most interesting person I've ever met, period, hands down. Anyway, all right, so 1,500 people. How many countries? 25 countries. 25 countries. Most of them, what? Investors, startups, entrepreneurs, what, CEOs? It's a great comment. It's a, it's a mix. It's uh, AI leaders from big tech companies like IBM and Microsoft and Nvidia and Oracle, etc. And entrepreneurs, people from startups, investors, so it's a really, really good mix. Even from the Israeli military, from some of the top units. Right. So just, um, you know, on my panel alone, I, we got Facebook, we got Logme, and we got some big names, right? Um, no, it's fine. It's all good. This is, a, this is a vlog. We can have noise in the background. It's a tech conference. It's all good. It's all good. <laughs> in the last couple of days, dude, big news in Israel. Yeah, big, big news, news. Amazing news. Just yesterday. Yeah, just yesterday. Yeah. Uh, Dynamic Yield, personalization acquired platform McDonald's. acquired by McDonald's. 300, 300 million, million bucks. In a viz. Uh, Wait, auto, hold on. Let's, talk, let's stick with McDonald's for one second. Yeah. These guys, you're going you're gonna to drive through McDonald's, right? You're going to have Israeli technology there. Amazing. Insane. Unbelievable. In a viz all, raised, over the, all around the world, right? The number one restaurants in the world. Uh, in a viz raised how much? One third. In a viz, $132 million. Autonomous driving. Unbelievable. Basically, right? Israel is completely leading the way, dominating like all verticals. Four other AI. startups raised between uh, four to twenty million dollars just yesterday. Just the last twenty-four hours alone. Yeah, yeah. Awesome, man. It's going to be a fantastic event. And earlier this month, of course, Nvidia acquired Mellanox for six point nine billion dollars, second uh, exit in Israeli uh, history. Second biggest. Exit. Second biggest, yeah, of yeah. course. Right. Unbelievable. All right. So, two questions for you. Number yeah. one, are you doing a live stream today? Is my my panel going to be live streamed? Mm, I, I don't think so, actually. You don't think so? Okay. okay. Next I hear, time. I hear that. Second, more importantly, yeah. though. Who's in charge of taking good pictures of me? I'm just Ooh. kidding. Yeah. Thanks, dude. Thanks for having me. I'm excited. And, Thank you for coming. Uh, sorry, I couldn't. I couldn't. I, mean, I don't know. I couldn't MC today. So no, no, no. Next time. I, we'll do it. End. Thanks, dude. The first panelist has arrived. What's your name, sir? Kevin Yu. Kevin Yu. What do you do for a living? I'm the director of infrastructure for AI infrastructure at Facebook. Small company. 
Yeah, you know, little new, new startup. You yep. may have heard of it. Where are you based? Uh, Menlo Park, actually. Oh, I love it. I was just there recently. You know Guy Rosen and uh, the, the, the Onavo guys? No, the guys that Facebook acquired from Israel? Anyway, I was there recently visiting a couple of a couple of buddies over there. Anyway, man, great to meet you. We're going to have a good time on the panel today. Super casual, super like, you know, high level stuff talking about your insights. I, don't want, I want to do as little talking as possible. So that's your job. Oh, talk absolutely. Get me to talk as little as possible. Great. Thanks, Steve. Looking you forward to it. Do you have Facebook swag or anything from uh, Menlo Park? No, no, <laughs> but I hear the uh, office here has swag. It's so. true. Thanks. Nice <laughs> to meet you, man. Okay. Okay, cool. Thanks. The most important person in the whole conference, the coffee dude. Well, let me just start with the fact that we just did an interview and it was on the wrong camera setting, so we could do it again. That's number one. Number two, as I said before, the internet never ceases to amaze me because I know the numbers, right? And how many likes, how many followers, how many shares, how many views, whatever. But that's that's a number, right? Then you, you bump into a face, a person that actually is one of those people, and it's like, what's your name? Uh, my name is Maori Daniel. I am the um, global SMB business lead for emerging markets for Microsoft Bank. All right, so you're a hot shot, number one. Number two, we met years ago. We had a dinner, an influencer dinner, and I mentioned to you before that Talia Wolf was sitting next to me at that dinner. Talia yeah. Wolf was the person that whose house was destroyed this week by a, a, an incoming missile. Not to be a downer on our meeting, but I'm just letting you no, know. No, not at all. Uh, Talia's amazing, super like resilient family, yeah. unbelievable people. Anyway, shout out to Talia. But um, all right, so you lead the advertising business. What, what exactly is your kind of thing? I do. So I'm the business lead for small, medium business growth and uh, emerging markets. Israel is one of my markets. Love it. And it's all about small business. Uh, and growing them online. I love it. So we met two and a half years ago. We, we can't talk numbers because, you know, corporates and stuff, but we will say one thing. You have more than quadrupled your business in Israel for Microsoft Bank. We have. Israel has been fantastic. It's, it's the, the team and myself. Uh, it's such an incredible market and we're very fortunate to be spending a lot of time and with love great it. companies. So I have two asks. Yes. Ask number one. Let me know how I can help. I will. I mean it. I will. Anything I can do to help you guys would be a huge win. I'd love to help you guys in any way. Number two, where's my swag? Get on that, man. I will make sure I get it, DLL. I'm a huge fan of yours. Thanks, dude. I, Appreciate I, I swag, it. Swag will come. Love I'll it. your address right after. How do people How do people learn more about your work, what, I mean, Bing's work in Israel? Is there somewhere they could follow you or, or, any, or the team or learn uh, they more? They can follow the team. We're, we're always on social media, at Bing on Instagram. Okay. Um, and that's the global team, but is there any way to know more about what Bing is doing in Israel or it's just follow the... Follow me on LinkedIn. My name is Maor Daniel. We put a lot of updates on LinkedIn. Love it. Uh, don't follow me on Instagram. I'm fairly boring, but it's all good. <laughs> Thanks, man. Appreciate the time. All right. Thanks. The panel started shortly and is doing a dress rehearsal here. generate $4 trillion in value by 2022 and $60 billion in revenue by 2025. 8.30 a.m. Wow. We're kind of blown out, exposure here, lighting, yeah. Woo, it's intense. I'm the second but the best looking panelist today, what's your name, man? Hey, I'm Ben from Log Me In, how are you doing? Log Me In, I love that. What's your what's your title at Log Me In? I'm the head of AI for Log Me In. I love that the head of AI at Log Me In is an Israeli. Yeah. I love that, dude. Well. That's awesome. Where are you based? Great. We're based in Herzliya. We have a great office there. We're actually, the, the office is a permutation or an evolution of the previous company that was there called Nanorep, which was acquired by Log Me In. It was an AI company, Love it. and it formed the base of operations for AI in Earth Studio. Love it. We're going to have a good time on the panel today. Yeah. Looking forward, man. Nice to meet you, dude. Nice to meet you, too. Take care, man. We got most members of the panel here today. We got Amit, who you know. You guys are old friends. This guy, Le Levev, right? Levev? There we go. That's there the we go. One, yeah. what's, what's your first name? Nick. Nick, and what do you do? Uh, Founders Factory, head of business development. Love it. Oh, look who's here. You know, you know, this guy's a legend, a real life legend in, in, in the flesh. How you doing, man? And we, we met Kevin already, and Dan, you know, from Intelligo. So this is the gang. We got one more coming. I don't know where he is, but he's coming. What's going to happen today? Today, we're going to have 1,500 attendees here from 25 different countries. You're going to be able to choose between 50 sessions and three tracks. This is uh, the center stage. There's going to be a developer stage, two workshops by IBM and NVIDIA, hands-on workshops. There's a B2B one-on-one uh, -on -one meeting zone that you could all have uh, scheduled your meetings in advance, and if not, then you can do it next time. There's the finals of our startup competition, so 50, more than 50 startups applied to the competition. The 10 finalists are going to pitch here in the finals after lunch at 2.10, so I invite all of you to come here. 
Uh, last but not least, I want to say thank you. Thank you to our big sponsors, the platinum sponsors, IBM and Microsoft. There's IBM and Microsoft in the house. So thank you for helping us make this uh, conference a reality. And uh, people and computers, we produce 100, organize and produce 150 conferences every year here in Israel. We're one of the most active event organizers in the world. So uh, I invite you to check out our other conferences. I want to thank our MCs and our moderators for helping put together such an amazing program. I want to thank my team at People and Computers, um, and I want to thank all of you uh, to, for coming here. So have a great time. Thank you. The venerable moderator, the master of one, Mr. Hillel Food, to moderate our next panel. Please give him a warm welcome. I hope I don't fall. Thank you, sir. You're on. All right. What a lineup we have today. This is the opening session and panel, so we're going to kind of lay the infrastructure and talk about the basics of AI and what a lineup, what a team, what a panel we have lined up for this. Let's talk about the, I guess the, the first question that my mom asks me when I talk about AI is, are they going to take our jobs? She'll be worried about AI. She'll be scared of these things. Are they, you know, is this the Terminator, right? Tell me about what your thoughts are on that in terms of Facebook and in general. I think in general, I think that AI has gotten a lot of, a lot more recognition in the last few years. Those who have been involved with AI for many years will see that it's come, it seems to every decade or so or 12 years come about with some new innovation and everyone gets very hyped and then it settles down some and so forth. We talked about the benefits, the challenges, and I'm going to say something now that you probably can't comment on because of the comms, but I read last week an article about the New Zealand video, right, that was streamed live and how Facebook removed it in seconds. And, and, and like 200 people watched it live. But the scale, the sheer scale of Facebook, right? By the time they removed all the videos, you know, hundreds of millions of people, which is 0.00001% of the users on Facebook. So now your scale is working against you. And so the question is, and again, I know you can't comment on that specific thing, but when it comes to challenges of AI, what are, what are the main challenges that you find? Um, I think the main challenges are, probably come from two parts. One is from the technical side of just scale. at a tech conference in Tel Aviv, you bump into all kinds of cool people, including you. What's your name? Lotem. Lotem. And how did we meet? We met when you came to our uh, demo at Odyssey, and your mind got blown. It's true. And what happened since then? <laughs> wow. <laughs> I can't even describe. So like, I, I, I'll just give you a little background. I came in there. I came in. I tried the VR thing. You've heard me talk about it on the blog before. I tried it. It was like a different level VR immersive experience. And I'm like, okay, guys, I need to bring you. And I just got to bring in like a marathon of people, including like, we can't name names right now, but like. We don't have time to do anything else. <laughs> since I posted this blog about our VR thing. <laughs> Pre pretty significant names we've been bringing, huh? Pretty significant. <laughs> so one day when you're, when you're, when you're, you know, a multi-billion dollar company, we'll show those videos that I took of that guy. <laughs> we'll, we'll leave him, un he shall remain unnamed right now. Anyway, I'm running to my next meeting. It's good to see you. Nice surprise. You. You, were you inside for the panel? Yeah, I just uh, went out for a quick break. How was I, though? You were always okay. Uh, <laughs> nice. Alright, I'm out of here. Nice to see you. Yeah, you too. Bye. Bye. conference is going to be going on all day, but I am heading to Powtoon now. Successful panel, good morning, cool people. People and computers know what they're doing when it comes to event production. Now heading to Powtoon and then lunch later on at Memphis. What a day in Tel Aviv. Look at the skies. Fashion Mall. That's that mall. Meeting the CEO of Big Fashion Mall. And I believe he's also the CEO or a senior exec at the Retail Innovation Club of Israel. So he works with the country's largest retailers to adopt innovation and work with startups. Pretty cool dude. Hopefully I'll get him on camera. Ending the day 
with someone a whole lot smarter than myself. You've been on the vlog before, right? Oh, yes, we did. All right, you, you, we did that, what was it, like six, seven months? No, it was more. How long ago? Yeah, half a year ago. Is it? What's your name? Oran Paran. Oran Paran. You have two hats. Give me, give me your two hats. What do you do? I'm head of technology and innovation at Big Shopping Center. The big Shopping Center is where we're sitting right now. Right, we're okay. in the chain, in the mall. Yep. And we are, I'm also head of the, the Retail Innovation Club. You're CEO, right? Yeah, right. Okay, so the Retail Innovation Club is basically taking all the biggest retailers in the country and bringing them in front, you know, to understand the startup ecosystem and vice versa, right? Right, well, we've established a platform that really connects the retail industry and the startups in order to close the gap on our industry. Love it. Dude, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of big things cooking on your end. We're going to collaborate. We're going to do good stuff together. I'm excited about it. And uh, next time you meet, you also have to, you, this is now you set the standard because you brought the CEO of the mall to come meet us. So from now on, every time you meet, you have to bring a hot shot with you. Of course, of course. <laughs> Why would you? All right, man. For sure. Thanks. Fantastic. Thanks. Good to see you. What a day that was. What a day. Pretty exhausted. Tomorrow, Thursday morning, is going to be wild. I'm going to be in Serona, back-to-back -back meetings, and then heading to Google for startups to do a podcast with my good friend, Tommy Barav to talk about life hacks and optimizing my time, something I'm very passionate about and I've spoken and written about many, many times. Tomorrow's going to be awesome. See you then.